What's up everybody? In today's video, we're gonna answer the question, which one of these circular saw blades will improve the performance of your circular saw? So we're testing with three blades here today. They're all seven and a quarter inch. The first blade we're gonna be using is this Ryobi stock blade. This is included with the brushless Ryobi circular saw. So makes sense to test with that. The next blade is what I call the performance blade. This is the Diablo blade. This is a 24 tooth blade. It's carbide and sold at Amazon and Home Depot. And you know, something everyone considers that the premium blade. So we got to test with that. And lastly, for fun, check this beast out. Nothing special here. This is just a piece of steel with some teeth on it. It's been sitting in someone's garage for the last 20 years, but I thought it'd be fun to include in this video. So we have a bunch to do today. Let's start tearing through it. So keeping these tests simple always works the best. And that's what we're gonna do here today. We're gonna follow the KISS philosophy, which is keep it simple, stupid. So in today's first test, the cut quantity test, our blades are all brand new. These have never touched any wood, any of these blades. Secondly, the battery we're using today is right here. This is a Ryobi 18 volt, 1.5 amp hour battery. And you can see it's fully charged. I'm gonna charge it between each test. And lastly, the saw we're using right here is this Ryobi brush, a seven and a quarter inch circular saw. So at the end of this test, we're gonna know which one of these blades can cut the most amount of wood. Let's get to it. First up is the stock Ryobi blade. Blade number two, Diablo. Dead. We're going old school with the next one. This is the Irwin Retro Bleed. Blade. Not many pieces there. So now we're having a little fun. Check this out. We got snow to add to the mix here. So it is time for test number two, and I'm calling this the need for speed. Let me show you why. We're gonna start with each saw blade right down here at the start line. I'm gonna move as quickly as I can through this wood all the way down to the finish line, and we're gonna find out which one of these saw blades cuts the fastest. All right, guys, so in the future, I'm definitely gonna listen to you more. In fact, the reason why I did this test here today is many of you said, when you saw my other Ryobi circular saw reviews, Andrew, throw out that stock blade, this one right here, throw it out and go with the Diablo blade. And guess what? Based on my test today, that's a good move. So here's a Diablo blade. This outperformed the other two blades in cut speed and cut quantity. Now, the other thing we need to talk about is this blade right here. This should stay at your grandfather's house. Also, there's a video right there 
It's right over there, guys. I can see it where I actually review different Ryobi circular saws as well as different Ryobi batteries. Let's go.